All right, we got Wife Beater 34 in the bot lane against Abandon My Ace. Uh, volley matchup is not great for me. Volley kind of claps, Nunu, at all stages of the game. Like, I can never fight him. The only thing I can look to do is really steal objectives or crab from him. It's basically just pray I gank somewhere before he does or gank somewhere that he doesn't because most of the times, unless we focus the same target, me and whoever I'm ganking, uh, we lose. Go blue smite in them, because they're pretty uh, mobile. Let's go ward or red here. Pick volley is blind all the time. The only time I pick silent nowadays is if they... Yeah, I don't see a lot of silence anymore, because volley has more dueling potential for sure. What's the enemy team looking like here? So they got a GM jungler. We have a GM top. The rest is just all mastered. Bro, my whole team has D shields. <laughs> I should have bought a D shield. Maybe D shield Nunu is the new tech in the jungle, you know? Now, if we can get an early kill bot, that would be magnificent. But the odds that aren't very high because Karma and Ezreal is a difficult lane to gank. Because they have Karma speed up, they have Ezreal E, which is basically a second flash. But we could burn some, it's really good too. So we're doing the typical Red Raptors Gromp. If there's a gank mid or bot, we'll go for it. If not, then we five camp clear and look to grab. Yeah, Yas is doing a little bit of abuse to the victory. Could probably. Oh. Lord. Probably burn Victor's flash here, but hmm. questionable flash. I just don't know why he went into that bush to follow, you know? When it seemed like a pretty obvious bait. See if we can go bot, it's really all I can try and do here. Probably get Ezreal flash or counter flash. Didn't really get follow up from my team. Just pot up, try and regank. Their bot definitely backed off. I mean, I can try and go for it. Pretty big wave bot though. Okay. Like, I think we just need to try and not force and just give Cog kills as I can. Probably warded. I didn't want that kill, but I'll take it. Victor kind of misplayed that, so that's good. He had three biscuits too. Not that the biscuits would have saved him by any means, but it would have been nice if he asked to get the kill. But he's kind of. We just take this, please. Why are there never any snow dragons? Oh yeah, he can make one. Sucks that Renata got it. But that was Ignite. I'm not sure why he got Bramble, but probably just for more defensive stats. He really is kind of... Do we get anything from this? Oh, Renata diff. Oh my god, Renata diff. That was so big. We just, like, we forced that kill so hard when Renata put her passive on Cog, and it kept him alive, and that just won us the fight. 
I don't think I need Merc Treads. I think I still go play to Steel Cap since I have Tenacity. I will get Anti-Heal though since they have Trox Volley and Karma. Also, Thornmail did get buffed. Like Anti-Heal got a bit of a nerf, but Thornmail itself got buffed. Yeah, so it was doing the most to try and make us lose, I swear. Big R, big R, big R, or no? No. We get nothing because Cog died. He was bad, man. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is Yasuo doing, bro? I really don't know what Yasuo was doing there. Did he chase the own poor victor? Or? Whatever, at least at least I got the dragon. Cog dies, but I got the dragon. Like why, bro? Why? Oh, you're fucking dead, bro. Couldn't get in the fight. What do you mean? I was snowballing in. I hit two with W. What do you mean? In in pit. Oh, really? He's dead. Okay. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Aatrox has no GA now. Yeah, the fact we got his GA there is huge. I tried my best to zone the rest of them out of the fight while I was going on, too. I can't really prevent Aatrox from taking this tower, can I? We do have mountains, so we should actually probably kill him here. Yeah, so it's dead, no surprise. Jeez, he almost 1v2'd. He actually almost 1v2'd that. Kind of bonkers champ. It's a shame our Yasuo keeps dying. I don't think we do this. I don't think we do this, man. Okay, I get Thornmail. I honestly think I just go Knight's Vow. We have a Hyper Carry. Cog is literally our only chance to win. So if I can mitigate some damage, I think it gives us a pretty good chance to win. Oh, yes, yeah, did something. Okay, can we need Baron, please? Holy me. Never mind, we take this wave too fast. Okay, the only thing I really have to watch for is Ezreal R. Okay, Ezreal already used R, so... I think they're just giving this and they're gonna try and turtle. I get Knight's Vow and then I need some MR. So because it's later in the game, okay, I'm gonna go Kindle Gem because I don't have enough for Spectre's Call. I gotta go try and hope this thing. Oh, he just okay. Cog is just gonna one v nine people now. All right, well Yasuo did reach his power spike, so I think Crafters was right.
Alright, that's just me being Chad, making them waste everything to try and stay alive. Alright, well, GG. Cass pulled through with a banger karma pick. I'm interested to see damage. Obviously, Cog's gonna be like top of the charts, but I'm interested to see how much I did there. Um, yeah, like look at Yasuo's damage. Aurelia really kind of caught up. Like, I almost out damaged Yasuo as full tank and building Knight's Vow. Well. Um, but just with how the early game was going, I'll show you the, the recap of the game. Like, top was losing hard, Aatrox was super fed, and mid was losing super hard. So both really and Yasuo die for first blood. Um, then I, I was pretty much playing for bot, respectively, most of that game. Got them a good lead, we killed Karma a good couple times. Um, and then Aurelia and Yasuo are dying, Yasuo is dying. I got caught out, Yasuo and Aurelia, Yasuo and Aurelia. And then we started kind of dying more, but also turning things at the same time. Like Aatrox got a triple, but then we started kind of giving Cog kills, Cog kills, Cog kills, Cog kills. And then at one point, they just griefed the fight really hard in mid lane. You know what, let's go watch the VOD really quickly. I'll show you pretty much where we won the game. Okay, watch this. So, so we catch out Victor, but then he has Flash Ghost. Um, I end up ulting just to kill him. And then we're kind of in a bad spot here. We don't have Kog'Maw, he's over here. We got Karma's Flash though, Aurelia dies, and then Aatrox has ult, so he's just looking to go ham. But watch this, Kog almost dies too in this fight. So he's getting some good damage going. I'm looking to just kind of peel for him. He gets in a bad position. Chunked by Ezreal. He's still kiting though. I'm backing up so I can get Snowball. Renata gets caught. Okay, I Snowball in and then look at... Pog would have died. But he got Renata's ability on him. So then I just go in ham. I'm like, okay, we need to kill. We pick up a kill so Cog lives. We end up, he gets shutting down Volley and Aatrox. Either way, that was an ace. Huge swing of gold, huge swing of gold. Because if we go back, they were at 27, we were at 24, and that evened it up. Then there's another fight. All right, he has GA now. Okay, so look for a catch here. Don't get anything, just kind of back out. Volley ends up ulting in when nobody else is around. Yasuo is down here on Ezreal. I get a nice ulti off. Full ult charge. Kill volley. Then uh, Aatrox also dies. Prox is GA. I just look to zone here so they can make quick work of Aatrox and the team can't help them. So I'm just kind of soaking damage. Flash out. We end up getting a kill on Aatrox. Victor R is me. And then basically from that point, we just hard won the game even though we were still down gold. But that was really big for us.